like this. I'll drop my prime here as well. So uh, there we go. Another six up there. But definitely get in there. Gotta love that support. Let's forget I can finally get into this other side of winner's bracket right now. Bobby and Zuppy. That's a plan all day as we've already established. Let's see how that story kind of carries on. We're talking about story. Let's see if the story is here. Oh, that's the bong oh my rip. God. Okay. Yeah, five right. gifted. Okay, with the five gifted. All right. Yeah, five gifted does mean the bong rip. That's true. So that's what we're probably getting. We'll probably get it loaded. For, I'll get it loaded for some point. Yeah. Maybe before Grants, so. At least as, as late as that. Chicken Man right now. Chicken Man 400. Also I cooked, known as I cooked Bobby. a whole small little rotisserie chicken thing in the air fryer yesterday. It was very good. That sounds awesome. I put the whole cool. thing in there. You just press start. Air fryers are. I guess it's the same thing as an oven. They just needed a. It's like turning an oven into TikTok. That's what an air fryer is. That's literally what, yeah, it does. It's like you just like you, you just you just put the temperature setting for it and you just put whatever you need into it. It just cooks like in minutes. Uh, like an hour? That's crazy. So I mean, it depends what you're putting into it. It was like five pounds. That's okay. That's probably why it was so big. Cause like some things, you get like get, get like a bag of like some kind of frozen appetizer, put it in there for like ten minutes and it's done. But, like something like that. Something hefty like that. Not that many take a little bit of time. I'm sure, it was worth it though. Very good for taking longer with some oven. Speaking of what's cooking, Zuppy so got a little bit of edge here cooking, but not quite. Bobby interrupted that though. I know Zuppy getting hungry listening to this. He's trying to fry some bird himself right now, but. Uh, it's not just up to them. Bobby has something to say about that. Catch him on the top platform with that full hop there. That Falco is so scary on this stage. Able to just cover so much space with that full hop and having those active hitboxes out and then immediately being able to just land on those top platforms and continue with something else is so strong like we saw from Bobby there. Like, Zuppy trying to reposition to the top platform and so is Bobby. But oh, but with Bobby with the down air and everything, it just gives so much more versatility on your safety and how aggressive you're able to take space. That's a big advantage Falco has, especially when riding and rocking behind one of those lasers or something too, taking up all this space. But Zuppy, even it up stock-wise. Yeah, I feel like on a stage like this, you Falcon would definitely love having that space as well. Because how space you can cover with just like a simple full hop. And as you see right now, making so much mileage out of the game, that full hop to carry on this combo and almost finish it off. Maybe we'll do it right now. Great survivability there from Zuppy to keep it going. But that tilt, I take it. I won 90. I hope it does. <laughs> yeah, I'd say. Let's get the cheeky laser out a little bit, at least. But hey, coming right back in. Yeah, I like a little, a little bit of cheekiness every now and then. Mm -hmm. Speaking of, we talk about, talk about chicken, cheeky Nando's, but it's more of a European thing. Has been established. Well, I. Cheeky Nando's? Yeah, that's like a it's like a chain out in the UK basically. It's it's it's, it's, like, it's like chicken basically. So it's like the big thing out there. If I have any works uh, for yeah UK out there, it's kind of like kind of like their canes actually. You think about it. It's cool. Yeah, I'll try. It. If I ever go out there, I need a passport first before I can go do that though. I see to apply. I want to go to Gamble. I gotta get a passport. Some, uh, I just want to go to Greenland with these two. I mean, they could teach me a thing or two. Seems like some sort of hyperbolic time chamber when you put these two here. I mean, they're just looking straight Super Saiyan right now. Absolutely. Like I think, kind of expect them just playing each other like all day, as we were talking about earlier. They just know what they're gonna do. I feel like it's actually feel like they're kind of like unlock like you know like the third eye. That's what I kind of like to say sometimes. Just like see what, what they're kind of like, get a prediction of what they're gonna do next. Oh, wow. And Zuppy with that call out shine to take that first game. Sheesh. That was Sheesh up. Big call out. I love Bobby's and all the people that they've done this with their ability to not be afraid to give practice even immediately before the tournament and just continue and look at it as a learning experience and try and get the highest level of games out of their partner that they can. And Zamu has done that with Bobby as well before. I mean, Bobby S. Fop do that all the time. Yeah, now Bobby's doing it as well with Zuppy sitting in a call with them, talking to each other. Even if they're just joking around, there are times where you're you're dropping little notes here or there bouncing ideas off each other it really is just a healthy environment to learn and grow as an in player in a lot of in a lot of ways so i i like to see <laughs> these grand finals with these fleshed out players a lot of the time and zuppy zamu and bobby have all done it with each other now so this could potentially be an insane top three if these three are the ones to make it there i like the thought of them just being in the discord voice call during this too i imagine they're just muted right now playing each other but like it's like all right i gotta mute real quick i have to play like an actual set too it's yeah. like this or eventually like winners final slash grand with sam is sitting there in there, in there too 
but already I, I, I was talking. I forgot how Bobby lost his stock immediately, too. I didn't realize he had three stocks left, but it may not matter because Zamu, I mean, no, not Zamu, Zuppy, getting all those Z's confused again. Trying to get more of a train going. Our final three players and winners. Battle it out to make winners finals and guaranteed top three. And you do not want to be in losers in this tournament. I repeat, you do not want to be in losers in this tournament. Let me just read off some of the names already. B bats, Mott Money, Salt, Mech. I don't know which one you would want to play, but I don't care who you are left in this bracket, Zuppy, Bobby, or Zamu. There is a very real chance you lose to any of those players who are still left in losers. Look, so no this tournament is hard. Exactly. Any of these matchups could very genuinely go anyway. They're obviously favorites. There's obviously set history, but these players are out here and they've been out here for a minute. Bobby usually doesn't miss that wave land and probably would have taken Zuppy for a ride had they not. So catching a bit of a break there. Zuppy probably had down the, the corner. Pretty sure Zuppy's had the edge recently, right, Stell? Uh, I feel like he has because he won last week over him. I know Bobby got a reset on him last four. week. Yeah, so it's usually pretty Zuppy favorite, I feel like. But definitely Bobby has this one where he can definitely take the win. I'll, I'll look at the head to head after the set's probably done so we can get more into it. But I know last week got pretty close, and then like recently, these usually go like really back and forth up between these two. Yeah. Recency bias wise, I think it's been Zuppy overall, probably Bobby, which I think is. I mean, Bobby's just been so good for so long, too. Yeah, been running for age for years, basically. It, it feels it's so long ago that Bobby beat HBox. You know what I mean? And I feel yeah. like that's one of the first things that I think of is Bobby's win over HBox and some of the stuff they did in Falco Puff when not as many players were doing it or getting wins like that. I mean, Bobby, Bobby definitely did it with a little bit different of a swagger and kind of set the precedent for doing it the way he does it if that makes sense yeah this the, the unique Here style of falco that he employs basically that was a very intricate way to describe it because like back around like 2017 2018 i want to say that was it's like at that time it's really it's, most people are going like are going fox around that time hbox is dubbing the entire scene so you see like anybody play hbox they'll probably bust out a fox at some point in the set especially like the top echelon level of melee but for bobby to come along and just do it with falco which you don't really see around that time it's like okay so there is a possibility here they you know that we don't have to go box all the time you know bobby showed that but we're seeing right now ooh, and zuppy simply holding the ledge to take that one sometimes you know what's gonna be more <laughs> all right well let's see here where do we think we are going let's see you're going into game three here Bobby wants to go for a smaller stage. Maybe he goes for Yoshi. But considering the play style that these two want to employ, maybe you want to have second thoughts about that. Maybe Stadium. That would be one of those two. Oh, well, they're all, they're, okay, so chat telling me right now that they're actually they're still on call and Bobby is dead out raging. I imagine like, they must both not be muted. That's hilarious. Okay, he opts to go back. I, I can respect that, considering yep. what these two might know about each other. We don't. <laughs> But already immediately, Bobby goes right to sent the ledge, but comes back on stage. Oh, wait, hold on. This is looking like Bobby. And that quick Falco combo shining like a diamond right now. Oh, looking for a big one, potentially. This up air. Oh my goodness, Bobby. Oh my God. You didn't have to do him like that. Still. Venting out the frustration that Chad alluded to there, Trey. Bobby looking like himself, a man on a mission to keep this set alive. Oh, Mr. Rager, yo. Mm -hmm. Getting that, getting that, all that mauled energy out, as someone would like to say. God damn, but Zuppy just holds the ledge and we're back to a 3 3 game. Kid Cuddy. Oh, I love Bobby's ability to just go through those platforms, act like they're not even there, and focus in on the target, per se. Down throw. Uh, try to get a little bit oh. of a mix up. And Zuppy just not cleaning up at the ledge, getting caught there. I feel like Bobby said something to him after that, too. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, said a little some guy like, oh, yeah, some some like some kind of banter I'm sure I'll look up I can watch the VOD and see what he said basically it's always the fun part about this kind of like tournament run stuff that people do I feel like it had something to do with uh, Zuppy getting coitus on is uh, the avenue that I would assume it went it probably right. probably something among that <laughs> among, you said among like among us oh uh, among us. <laughs> <laughs> God, 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 the subtle of Muggus in there. <laughs> Society is just tainted. Once That's say Every now and then, there's just something that comes and sets the bar lower. Like, this sets, this like the, the subtlest thing. As unintentional as that was, too, to say that, I was, I wasn't even aware of it. Or the simple of Mogus, just people look the same too. I literally just be at work, and I'll see like on a whiteboard in the back, and I'll see, I'll see a Mogus on it. Oh no, it's found its way here too to my job. Like just to sell all those things that people do out there, just keep that trend alive. 
Oh my goodness, Bobby. and again with the reverse nares. We were seeing him from Demo earlier on the Fox, and you know, we're talking about two sides of the same coin. These players really seem to be taking pages out of each other's books, and we've been seeing some beautiful, innovative gameplay from these spaces in the past year or so. Mm -hmm. Talking about staying alive, too. Bobby trying to keep his turn. These winners, uh side of the racket helps alive. Ooh, three quick shots. It's going to be another Bobby combo, potentially. Bobby's movement's so tricky, just forcing you to make a slight mistake. And as Drug Fox says, it's not that top players don't make mistakes, it's that top players will not let you make a mistake for free. You are going to get punished, and you are going to take something for it. So make sure to get yours. It says, you know what? I just realized, Marshawn Lynch and Drug Fox have the exact same quote. All right, Drug Fox. Okay, go off. Top players aren't going to get hit. Is that they're not going to let you make a mistake for free. All right. Quote Marshawn Lynch. I know I'm going to get got, but I'm going to get mines more than I get got, though. And I think that is the mentality you need in these scrappy matches as well. You know, you got to be willing to take a hit on the chin every now and then. Can't be having a little bit of the glass jaw here. But. Hey, man. Hey, I'm just, I'm just here so I won't get fun. I'm just leave it with that. <laughs> I'm just here, so I won't get fined. <laughs> iconic. That's an iconic one. That's like that's like one of the best. It, I, that was that was his last season. That's, I think it's that his last Super Bowl that I think he played in. But that was that was something to remember. A line for the ages. That's how, oh, that's, that's another Bobby combo. Oh my god! To the clip, rip it, ship it, send it to China. It doesn't matter. Bobby not skipping a beat. Absolutely destroying this first up stock right now. I'll be turning it on when he needs to. Oh boy. Going with a beast mode potentially, but hold on, Zuppy. Yeah, maybe Marsh on land. <laughs> say, this is this is turning turn, turn to a highlight reel. He's, he, he's rocking the kind of the Seahawk colors too. Got the I green. Know. Yeah, so it's a, fittingly enough. Well, he's from the Pacific Northwest. That only adds to it, but not in this case. Oh, I'm stuck. He's living, but another shine. Yeah, all Zuppy needs to wrap that one up. So Zuppy, quick momentum shift, but Bobby's still gonna ride the high that he's on potentially. Even the game back up, that should do it. Oh, well, great DF from Zuffy to stay alive. Rinse and repeat. Does even it back up. All right. These rolls on the platform. Rolling on the platform, something underrated. Spark and uh, Fiction have talked to me about at different points, especially Spark, about how underrated that type of uh, movement on the platform is. Sometimes people linearize platforms and what they are, but it really is just basically a floating piece of the stage and all your options are still available to you there for the most part. So make use of them. Oh, you, oh can you say that too? Up and beautiful platform setup as you called out, Stelia. Zer oh, caught the DIN God. on the double dare and he set it up like it was the knockout contest. Oh Unless my God. Bobby, brother. Speaking of Bobby knockout contest, you saw Bobby like shoot the beanbag exactly 420.69 feet on KO toss. Oh, I need to see that back now. That's That sounds too fittingly enough. Especially yeah. if you got chicken with the name Chicken Man. Oh, just Chicken Man 420. That would make it even better. But damn. As much as up he's fighting back, Bobby with a potential Game reverse 3-0. And as you've alluded to, you know, that Marshawn Lynch influence, potentially we got a beast mode situation. Baby. This could be looking like, is this more of a Seahawks versus New Orleans Saints or what was I think 2009 situation that we're in right now oh he's gonna find gosh. that one handoff run all the way down the field and get to that touchdown let's find out as we head to a game five scenario loyalty, baby. it's the fourth quarter and this is the drive potentially can Bobby finish it off Marshawn Lynch has a bar in Oakland and it was on bar rescue with John Taffer it was it's a hilarious episode everyone go watch go. it when I'm done here I need to go watch that or try also Badlands it. Chugs the guy who chugged the ocean was on wife swap and Bobby's about to be on your next favorite combo video if he keeps hitting Zuppy with combos like this. I'd say, like, the next thing. We talked about PGH Carroll earlier. This is, like, the next potential, like, competitor to that, basically. He's, he, he keeps riding this high. Bobby's definitely been a combo video innovator, especially in the Twitter sphere. Bobby is, when he was rocking those Twitter combo videos all the time, they were, uh, but it worked. So again, that's how you get noticed, too, and then this kind of age as well. My fact then, I know Twitter where I wasn't as optimized for melee, but when these days, well, you'll find clips all the time on Twitter from different people. I, I know I got something I, I wanted to make earlier from when I was playing unranked, but you know, sorry for another time. Combos. I just get players that are good enough to get good combos in my tournaments. Shout out to Garbage Connection. So the plug. 
Oh my goodness, that was scary. I oh, thought Poppy oh. was getting knocked out. Zuppy, 42%. Out here, Jackie Robinson gonna try and steal this base, maybe a stock along with it. Oh my gosh. Zuppy should move. Oh, he's stealing that base, as you're saying. Sometimes you try so hard and get so far, but in the end, it yeah. doesn't even matter. Oh, uh, okay. good. Man, he's moving around these bases quick. You, get, you got we right now he's home plate. Going over the third base. Oh my Dunks gosh, on him. Ruth home and run. Oh my god. <laughs> my god. He's going off. I want to see another one. Yeah, we got in the Hall of Fame. Can I get a big can I get one for Big Bobby? Yeah, Go to the Hall of to, Fame. Can we get a test for Bobby after this? I uh, I would like to have Bobby tested officially. <laughs> Wait, we don't want to see any steroids. I want to see it. Don't, don't, don't want to bury Bond situation. Oh my here. gosh. don't tell me he's gonna go he's gonna go sicko mode on him isn't he Trey he might be oh okay okay hold on hold on relax relax he's human he's human Barry Bonds is still the best baseball player of all time no cap doesn't even matter yeah, those are two takes and a half right here but whew. Chad what do you think about that Ooh, oh sends that ball over left field nice nah, going back he's coming back Zuppy keep this alive, but Bobby wants this reverse 3 0. Center stage right now. Is this what is this the home run? It's going to do it, and it yeah. does! Zuppy! <laughs>